Hey YouTube, it's Rob. I have a, a really good uh, video for you today. This one is outstanding because um, I'm going to tell you, if this doesn't attract the attention of um, scientists or geologists, I, I don't know what to say. I mean, I, I'll, I'll be baffled because I'm going to show you something, man, I can guarantee you've never seen or heard about before. Um, let's start here's Africa and um, you notice how Africa has got this beveled edge right here and stuff I always kinda wondered what what made that now <clears throat> I'm gonna show you and more okay let's move Africa here we've got the Mariana Trench right here and Australia and stuff and the spill out so, you see how that lines up right there? Let me show you right here. Like that. Okay, and then you can see even it, it overlaps there. Okay, this gets better though. This is actually going to be pretty mind blowing. All right, so like I said before, um, what created the the eye of the Sahara over here is this, because you can see that it lines up. But I've noticed that there's some um, you can see it also here, it can line up here. I just want to make sure you guys see all the, you, that, you're, that you're confident as I am that this was sitting like this at one time. You can see the, the markings, how they go like that, and then they continue on. Right here. And even here, I think. Yeah, it does. Because here it is, but it's faint. But it does come back. And then that right there. So I just want to make sure that whoever's watching this is comp confident that this happened right here. And then you can see also over here, as this lines up here, it, it's kind of hard to see, but I'm sure that this stuff had something to do with the markings here. And you know, if that's something you want to find out on your own time, that's that'd be cool. But um, okay, so but then if I push it in further, you see this dark area right here. There, you see how it lines up in there. there see it you can see that you know the swirling and you can tell that this is this is all related right here I don't know if it goes that far but maybe it does so maybe this just spit this out huh but I noticed that there is a, a crisscross action here. You got this on top of this, this going this way, and, and this is like that. So what happens if I flip flop uh, Africa like that? See, it's flip flopped. Um, so let's do this. Right out the gate, I can tell that this is going to line up in there. Like that. Maybe bring it in some more. Um, yeah, bring it in. There we go, like that. This green line again. That dark green line. It's weird. Um, 
Okay, so you see that we're getting we're getting alignments here and here. And remember, this is flip flopped. So that's pretty incredible that we're getting uh, alignments flip flopped. But what I noticed is that here's the Aya Sahara again, and it happens to be laying in this area where there's like this is the Hawaiian Island chain well it's connected to the Hawaiian Island chain and it and it hooks like that but I noticed that it uh, this hooks like that too so I'm wondering if this is touching the eye of the Sahara and then when I flip flop it this is touching the eye of the Sahara then maybe maybe this folds over I mean that's the only thing that makes sense why would they be touching the eye of the Sahara at the same time unless they were the same thing and they were folded into you know making contact or whatever and maybe something else is going on here so what I'm gonna do is I want to um, I want to see if that's true so here's a close-up of Africa and what I want to do is I want to take a, snap, a copy of this area and, and then flip flop it and see what it, how it lines up over here. Okay, so now I'm over here. Here's my snapshot. I flip flopped it so it's it's reversed. And um, first on, I notice that this lines up right here. And then um, I noticed that it, if I put this rotation under here, where I believe this is rotation also, um, we'll see what happens. Well, first of all, you can see that this is lining up over here. Let's see, hold on, I gotta think about what I'm doing here. Yeah, okay, we push this in. You can see what, you know, that something's happening. You can see that, that these, these do match up. I think I need to uh, rotate it a little bit. Okay, I think that helped, and I actually noticed some more here. Okay, so that went there, kind of, yeah, like that bring this in I noticed that uh, you see this area right here and this go together and you can you can start to see other alignments um, but this is what that goes in here you can see that these these line up as I bring that dark area, the dot or whatever here, and line this up here. Okay, I increased the clarity on this overlay so you can see the texture better, but uh, I wanted to show you, okay, okay, this right here. so you can see the alignments better and then we go over here but I also wanted you to see you see how that fits in there all this dot fits in there see how it just when I move it around it fits in multiple places that's just the way it's it's always been now um, because this is like a point just made everything I'm sure that's it probably right there but um, I want you to check out um, Italy not only do I think that Madagascar somehow ties in with it um, but I wanted you to check this out um, see how 
this lines up with it. And then this lines up with it. And there is a big mystery about where Italy got its its uh, mountains. And uh, I already, you know, I solved it before, but there, apparently there's multiple places that, that these, well, these all sat on top of each other or whatever. So this is another area that made its mountains. And I wanted to show you, where did it go? Is it this one? Yeah, it might be that, this dark area. Um, but I think it was also the something in here. Maybe I'm tripping. Uh, oh yeah, the, well you see, you see the hexagon, partial hexagon dark colored, the area right here. You see how it lines up perfect? As this lines up. This probably lines up in there too. I don't know. You can see the, uh, the, you know how it's scalloped or whatever. Usually that's a sign of electrical. You, you can see that this is related in every way possible. You can see how it keeps lining up. It's almost effortlessly. I seriously just barely move this around, and I just it just starts magically lining up. Oh god, I hate that when that does it. This thing gets out of control sometimes. Um, but yeah, you can see it lines up here. It's going to line up everywhere. I see this, you know, that this weird looking face, kind of square face guy. He lines up too. So want to you should just do your own overlay and trip out on this okay I wanted to uh, do that uh, crossover you know uh, that I was talking about uh, here um, with this uh, the, the Fiji Island and um, Hawaii but I noticed something um, when you check this out you can see that they're gonna line up or something. Oh, let me see if I get it just right. too. It's like this is the point where it starts to uh, flip-flop or rotate. I think this is this is the, you know what this is? I think this is the eye of the vortex uh, here. Um, well, I'll get back to that. Um, I just want to check out this alignment first. See how it like it looks like it even pulled away. That's wild. This is the Hawaiian Island chain. Dude, it even looks like that pulled away from it. Look. Well, let me get more up. There we go. You know what I think this 
this is. Uh, well, not only is it related to the ro the vortex, uh, sometimes I'm kind of wondering if this is like a miniature version of it spinning around and cruising along, getting bigger. But I'm not sure about that. I'm just, that's just, I'm just wondering. That's something I'd have to prove. Um, but for now, I'm just going to prove this. Because now I'm going to flip-flop this. You see how well this lines up. And you see that this goes that direction. And then this goes this direction. So, let's flip-flop it. There we go. Now it's flip-flopped. But it seems to be where this is where it sits currently now, I guess. I'm sure that I could rotate this and this would line up and all that with that. But uh, I don't know if it's necessary. I mean, everything's fitting so good so far. I doubt this would be any different. And then just like the Hawaiian Islands, This fits in here too. Just want to make sure I get it right. Yeah, it's got to be right here, like this. Yeah, just like that. Oh, right where it's at. Yeah. Same thing. So I imagine if I was to take the Hawaiian Islands chain right here, I bet you would fit right in here with it. Well, well it has to. So anyways, um, let's see what else we got. So it fits there. Fits in here, it looks like. Those are those knuckles that I was telling you about in the other videos. That's from rotation. So this has to be the, the vortex. Oh, check this out. You see this This thing looks like a, like a snap either something snapped or it's whipping but check this out so let's bring this in here this is like the re this is the reverse of that it's the same thing but bigger but then check this out now that looks now that looks like what it should be when it's rotating that looks like the eye of the you know uh, tornado I guess a plasma tornado Oh yeah, when this is in here, oops, I hate this thing, you can see that I already know that this actually fits in there when it's rotated correctly, but it does, oops, yeah, this, this is definitely uh, part of our coastline, by the way, um, at one time, so anyways, let me go back to that vortex, I want to show you something. Okay, yeah, what I'm thinking is that this is this is the eye, it's spinning. And I actually believe that we're getting two things here. Because we're looking at it in two dimensions, because, you know, our, our, the way we're looking straight down onto the earth, I think this is the top, and this is the, this is the actual vortex. And um, knowing that this is it, let's try a little experiment here. Okay, here I turned it sideways because I want to match it up where that crater is in China. Right here. Wow. This is one direction, right? Check this out. This is going to be a little bit difficult uh, to show, I think. Okay, you see this looks like a bird's head. And it be, looks like it's clamping down on this. And it's got that funny looking patterns to it. There. You see what I'm seeing? And 
this is okay this is my proof that this is rotating because this looks like okay it looks like the opposite of this so let me go get the other one there oops oh, let me get rid of this one first there it is yeah right there is turned so it's got to go like like maybe like oh that's what gives that oh I get this uh, there are, there are recurring patterns where it looks like this and it's got this swoop right through the top of it now I know where it came from it came from this because this lines up here perfect man that's wild don't you think I mean and then uh, yeah, up here, we got that. So this is, and then, what's this? I don't know, man, I was wondering, maybe if I turn this, this might actually fit in there. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. But I'll save that for another time. Anyways, uh, I hope you find this interesting and I'll be surprised you know if if nothing comes of this I mean I don't see how this could not I mean anyways hopefully if there's somebody out in the field that uh, a scientist or something that sees this you gotta know that there's something here all right thanks bye